Begin tonight with a terrifying home invasion where the person inside the home shot and killed a suspect. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Bill Baessa. Hello, I'm Dominique Soxa. That man fired his gun, fearing for his life. All of this happened in North Harris County at the Trails at Dominion Park Apartments. Local 2's Jennifer Bauer spoke with that homeowner's father, and she's live at the complex tonight with the very latest. Jen? Well, that father tells us his son was sleeping this afternoon when this all happened, and he woke up to some strangers trying to break in. A brand new video just into Local 2 shows bullet holes in the wall of this apartment. Investigators say the man who lives across the hall fired the shots because some robbers tried to break in. That man's father tells us his son was asleep when they came knocking on the door. They woke him up, you know, so, and he peeped out the peephole and, and he didn't recognize who the guys was. One witness said the robbers tried to pry the door open. And they used a crowbar. He said he saw the gun come around the corner and he started firing. One of the would-be robbers died at the bottom of the stairwell. Police say at least one other got away. It's unclear if there were two or three. It's a motive. Jaquela Render lives nearby and says everyone at this apartment complex is talking about how the tenant was targeted. They believe the robbers were after money. She says his parents are successful and he has nice things. It's a motive because you have other young guys who see them and they're envious and they want that. They want to be a part of that or they want to have that. Now, investigators wouldn't comment on whether or not these intruders had a gun, but witnesses tell us they were indeed armed. This case does remain under investigation. We're live tonight. Jennifer Bauer, KPRC, Local 2. Harris County Sheriff's deputies say one person had shown up at a nearby hospital with a gunshot wound. They're trying to determine if he is one of the intruders. This case is still under investigation.